Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it has been a while, but today I have a very exciting haul video for you. It has to be one of the biggest Timu hauls ever. I time ever getting things from Timu and I did take a sneak peek at some of it. So before we jump into the Timu haul, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe and follow me on my other social media platforms, which will be linked in the description below. Jump right into this $600 Timu haul. Just so you guys can understand how much stuff we have, this is one of three packages. And it is like the size of me. Okay, so for jewelry right now, I'm very much in my like gold era. I go back and forth. For the summer, I'm always gold. The winter, I'm always silver. Bunch of different pieces. I tried to get everything in stainless steel. I only like to wear stainless steel jewelry or of course like sterling silver. Because starting off, we have a ring. Super cute, kind of like a baguette style ring. Looks like this on the finger. Please ignore how orange my self tan is. I haven't rinsed it off my hands yet, but super cute, very heavy, thick, feels good quality. Next thing is a bracelet. This might be one of my like favorite pieces of jewelry in the haul. It looks like this. It's all these bedazzled, smiley faces. Super cute. We'll have to see how the rhinestones last or if they fall out really easy. That's a big pet peeve of mine when you get jewelry like this. But super pretty. I love stacking just like a whole bunch of bracelets. So this is a perfect one for that. Next, we have another ring. This one is like a really big, chunky dome ring like that. Very cute, chunky. I love a ring like this. X is the only silver piece I got. I keep having to pause for the construction. This is what I get for living, you know, where they're making the new subway station in Toronto. Super cute, mixed metal, little chunky hoops. Very simple. They're a bit smaller than I thought. Like they're not very big. So I think I might put them in my seconds, but yeah, really cute. Coming in with another bracelet. I love this one too. It's like a little Van Cleef dupe. I wanted to get the one that was all gold and Timu had it. I think for like $5. So I got it and it's super pretty. Again, this is one I'll just layer and stack and wear a whole bunch of bracelets. I have a necklace. You've probably been seeing necklaces like this everywhere. I've been wanting to get one so bad, finally did. It's one of the like bubble letter necklaces. That's them making the subway. So my name's Sarah. So I got an S. This one looks pretty cute. I like it a lot. This is a cute like staple necklace yeah very heavy so feels good quality to me okay this piece is my favorite piece from the jewelry section of this haul it's this little vintage looking watch i have a ton of vintage watches from my grandma so i know this one's not actually vintage but it has that look i had to get it because the bands are pearls i thought this was so unique and so pretty love dainty little watches like this i'll stack them with a bunch of bracelets very pretty Next is this set of hoops. So it came with two pairs, chunky gold hoops. So it came with two pairs, these two different sizes. I'll wear these um, as kind of like a statement. These ones are a little bit smaller, so I'll wear these when I'm like stacking a bunch of different earrings. If I'm feeling really crazy, I might even stack both, but you can never go wrong with having too many pairs of gold hoops, different sizes, different shapes, different chunkiness levels. So these are super cute, perfect. There's two pieces of jewelry left. One is this necklace. I wear cross necklaces like every day, but I'm always looking for different ones that are like more unique than the ones I already have. And I really liked this one. It's just bedazzled, sparkly gold, little cross. Very and then the last item is another bracelet. This one's a bangle. I love bangles. I wear like my Cartier ones all the time, but this one's really cute because it also has some little can you tell I'm into bedazzled, sparkly stuff right now? It's also very cute. It just has kind of gems around the band. I was wrong. I found two more pieces of jewelry in the next package. So very quickly, one is just this very dainty little ring. But if you look closely, it has an S on it. It's so cute. Okay, it's literally perfect. At last, another necklace that is a bubble letter S. However, going on with the theme here, this one is bedazzled and sparkly and very pretty. Okay, that's all for the jewelry. Next, we're gonna get into the fashion. So clothes and shoes. I don't have a lot. I got a lot of home stuff. That's like the biggest part of this haul. But yeah, let's hop right into it. Starting off so strong. This is the best fashion piece. Mm. There's also a dress. 
I wore these the other day for dinner with my girlfriend and she was obsessed. She thought they were beautiful. I think they're beautiful. I think they're perfect and amazing. And they are these red knee high boots. Oh my God, you guys. If anyone knows me in my personal life, you know I'm like a knee high boot girl. I have a million pairs of knee high boots, black ones, cowboy boot ones, whatever it is, I have it. I didn't have red. I have red knee high cowboy boots, but not regular ones. These are the perfect cherry red. They're amazing. They were quite comfortable. They hurt my feet a little bit because it was my first time wearing them. Um, and the heel is like a little bit, a couple inches high and I'm like really bad at walking in heels, but I'm literally obsessed. I already know I'm gonna wear these all the time. They're the perfect going out boot and they're off Timu. So they're so cheap. The quality feels quite good. I will say I love these. We have two other pairs of shoes. I wanted some new little slingbacks for the office. Okay, these are so cute for work or for whatever. I'm really into like pointed toe, like kitten heels, ballet flats right now. I feel like it's very in and I like that trend a lot. These are so cute for the office as well or like even like out for dinner. Okay, one more pair of shoes. Okay, I love these almost as much as the red boots. Oh my God. Pointed toe, strappy buckles, little kitten heel. They're like a burgundy, very deep red, like deep red wine color. So beautiful. I am having a lovely girls weekend. I have an event tonight, then going out with my girlfriend. And then I have another friend tomorrow where we're going for a really nice dinner and then out as well. I will be wearing these. Oh my gosh, all the outfit ideas are like flooding my mind. I am so excited about these. They're beautiful. Okay, jumping into clothing. First thing is this little top. I love backless, strapless tops. It's like a little bandeau tube top, open back. It just has straps across the back. Really cute. It has these little like buckles on the front, which is kind of fun. I think you're supposed to, hold on. Yeah, clip it together like that. So just a little buckle on the front. That's kind of a cute, different detail than most little tube tops. And again, I love the open back. Then we have this matching set, which I'm so excited about. I work a hybrid job, so I work from home quite a bit and I'm always looking for like comfy loungewear sets when I work from home, other than when I have meetings because then I'm on Teams and I will wear pajama pants and like a blazer. But when I'm just like around the house working, light gray, long sleeve, a bit cropped kind of t-shirt. And then it has like the yoga pants bottoms that you fold over. You're very cute, light gray, sort of a flare. Material feels pretty nice. I'm sure it'll be a bit see-through because it is from Timu. It's not the highest quality in the world. However, for the price and stuff, pretty good. Next, we have this dress. I already know where I'm gonna wear it. One, me and one of my friends are gonna do like a winery day this summer. This is what I'm gonna wear. Jello, little blue flowers, the most perfect summer maxi dress. Straps go up and then again with the open back. I know it's kind of hard to see, but you'll tie the straps like across the back. Very cute, very flattering, and it's a maxi and it's slit in the leg. I love a dress that's this style. I think it's the most flattering and I love maxi dresses honestly more than I like like little mini dresses. So this, so pretty. Okay, this is my favorite clothing item. Maybe my favorite fashion item other than the red boots. It is the best dress ever. I wore it the other night and I don't think anything has ever been so flattering. It looks like this leopard print, which I love, little tie in the front, maxi dress. You can even tell that it kind of like gives room for your hips, which is really great. Yeah. I am a little bit, I have a larger butt, so I find dresses kind of difficult. A lot of the time it's like way too tight on my butt, but then I'm quite small, so I have to get like really small sizing. So it fits me like a glove. Maxi again, I think anything's ever been more flattering. I will insert the TikTok I made wearing the dress here. This is the best dress ever. Okay, that is all for the jewelry and the fashion. Next, we're gonna get into home stuff, which there's quite the pile on the floor in front of me right now. We will start with this bag. This is beautiful. Are you kidding me? It came in so many different colors. I like the yellow. I kind of wish I got the pink. 
um but i thought like i have a lot of pink decor actually going on in the new apartment so i thought i should switch it up a little bit so i got the yellow because i thought it made it even more like a vintage mid-century modern looking but i cannot believe i got this lamp off timu i go in my office i'm working on my home office right now and i think this would be so beautiful like a whole bunch of random things in the home part of the hall so i'm just gonna like rip through them um car vacuum cleaner or little mini vacuum cleaner i don't know i've always wanted one of these now i have one this is a cat hammock looks like that it goes in the window my two cats love sitting in the windows and watching birds and i have the cat tree at one window but i need something for the other window so we're gonna give this a try a rapid fire through a few other items then there's a couple more exciting home items at the end this is under the bed storage if you live in Toronto, like I do, or anywhere of the sort, big cities, apartments do not have closet space. They really don't. Places are small. You need stuff like this. Next, I got new little dish towels. Again, I'm going kind of pink with this apartment. My stuff to be pink. So there's a striped one, a little plaid one, and just a pink one. Little hand towels, dishcloths, whatever, for the kitchen. You know you've become an adult when something like this gets you really excited. It is a under the cupboard paper towel holder and it came with a little sticker. You can screw it in or you put the sticker on. It sticks under your cupboard, keeps your paper towel off, taking, off the counter, saving you counter space. Next item, I don't know if I'll really be able to show you. It's a new stand for my like skincare stuff. I'm going to have to build it. I'll insert a photo here of what it looks like because I'm going to have to put it together. Okay, next we have a new towel set. I'm a little iffy about this. The texture feels kind of weird. So I'm going to throw this whole set in the wash and dryer and see if that helps. Cute. So I hope it works out. Bath towels, white and pink stripe. Came with two bath towels, a couple like hand towel size, and a few like face cloth size super cute super pretty super affordable i'm probably more excited about this than i should be it is a little cowboy boot match holder it didn't come with matches i thought it would have come with matches but it doesn't but it comes with little stickers so you can light your matches on it i'll have to buy some matches i guess little pink cowboy boot matches holder you can definitely tell the pink theme is still going strong a little bath mat and it's gonna say you look good cute you look good this with the pink bath towels so cute new skincare stand in the bathroom on the vanity again this stuff was so affordable that i can't even like complain okay this item's like a little boring but it's a little cart again i'm gonna have to build it but it'll be a little three tier plastic cart I was thinking for the kitchen, but now I'm thinking for my office because I ended up having more counter space or sorry, cupboard space in the kitchen than I thought, but it'll be like three tiers. It'll roll around on its little wheels. Just good for extra storage, something cute, simple. You always need organization stuff. Something I noticed Timu had a lot of on their website and looked really good was their glassware. So I got a bunch of different glass things. First thing is these soap dispensers. I'm going to put them in the kitchen, one with hand soap, one with dish soap, because I have a cute one in the bathroom already. These are so pretty. The glass is so thick. They feel really good quality. Something you get at like Home Sense or Winners, but again, really cheap because it was on Timu. I love these. I think like soap dispensers are the best way to make your space feel like rich and elevated. It's not cute, aesthetic, nice, luxurious decor two more items this one and then one more i am so excited about this look at these martini glasses ribbed martini glasses if you know me you know i am a martini girl especially cosmos these are beautiful they're so cute i absolutely love these there's four of them these are going on the bar cart for sure. Last items of the haul. Just these really cute little, I hate styrofoam, ribbed glass, drinking glasses. Just got two, came in a pair of two. I think you could get it in a set of four or six as well, but I just needed two. I have a cute set, but I just wanted to add a couple more 
glasses, very pretty. Okay, you guys, that is everything for my ginormous Timu haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed and maybe found some things that you like. Again, I'm gonna link what I can in the description, do the best that I can, but definitely check out Timu. I am so happy with everything. I don't think there's a single thing I don't like. Definitely gonna be a Timu shopper now. This was my first time again getting anything from Timu. Super impressed. Before you go, make sure to give this video a like and comment down below if there was something from this that you really like. Have you shopped from Timu before? Let me know, I'm new to this. Make sure to subscribe and follow me on my other social media platforms which are linked in the description below. Bye guys.